welcome back. Uh, as you can see from the last episode, I got shot and uh, Eric ran away, but the bandit didn't kill me. He only just took my gear and uh, I ended up, he took me over here for probably some experiments and while he's out uh, searching for more stuff, I thought I'd come on and uh, get out of here while I can. This seems to be like some sort of junkyard. So I'm just going to head out of here and then meet up with uh, Eric somewhere. Hopefully we won't be too, s too not too long meeting each other. Not too long meeting each other. Like what we kind of stuff. Actually, I picked up some of his items he, he'd left around, but he's put me in this sort of clothing, experiment clothing. Obviously, you can see my number and how many people he's done it on, which is uh, which we need to go help those people. I didn't see any. He's probably got little bits dotted around everywhere. So I'm um, to look around the junkyard anyway. Uh, I don't know. I don't. I think he's going to be quite a while gathering supplies. But if he comes back, I'll have to. I found a little hidey place. It's just round here. If he comes back, um, not a lot of gear. Uh, just found some. I haven't searched the space. Not a lot of gear. I found a frag grenade and stuff, but not not too much. Is uh, is is here. So uh, this looks pretty cool. Yeah, there's um. Not a lot. I don't know if I can get into these buildings. Um, I've had a look. I know you can get onto the roof, but that's, there's not much on there. I've already been up there. Uh, it's a good view though. I'm glad he hasn't only got any buddies around, because if he did, I'd be I'll probably be shot and put into the let's have a look. put into some sort of chain so I couldn't move. This looks promising. As you can see, they've got a nice little fire set up here. Obviously, he wasn't alone when he did it. Oh, there we go. That will start up. Start like that. Obviously, I don't have the go karts mod, so I can't get it. That's brilliant. I do apologise about that. Obviously, you need mods to get stuff. Uh, cigarettes and stuff. He's obviously. He's obviously been here. Right, well then, uh, the point that me and Eric said we were going to meet would be uh, would be north of of where I am. I am all the way down here. I'm in the junkyard. What we want to do is we're going to head into this town and we're going to find some gear in it, hopefully. <laughs> and then we'll probably head over to the uh, military base over there. We are going to meet up at the power station here, so that should take us a few times. So let's just uh, get out of this junkyard. And um, if I if I can, there is, here we go. And let's see what we can find from the town. Right, so let's get going. So we are here at the town. Uh, a little bit of FPS. Oh god, there's a lot of zombies there. Um, I have nothing to kill these with, so I've obviously not got to stick around for too long. Uh, three zombies right there, that is terrible luck. Um, we're just going to quickly run around here and try and find some sort of vehicle that maybe get us to where we want to go faster. Maybe uh, some sort of weaponry or something like that. I think I just outrun them. I need to get in this house. Shut the door. So the zombies don't can't come in. Yeah, if you shut the door, the zombies can't come in. I really hope there's some sort of equipment I can use in here, possibly something to get me out of these clothes. If those bandits see me like this, they're going to... There's a lot of zombies around, and I'm... Okay, there we go. There we are. That is a lot of zombies. I hope there's... I really, really do hope there's not going to be a horde spawn, because if there is, and I'm by myself with no equipment, I've just got to run. Uh, there's no way I'm going to be searching this city if there is a horde spawning in. There just seems to be a lot of broken down houses as well. I don't know whether I want to. I don't know if I want to stay here too long. I don't think there's any gear around for me anywhere. Uh, some gear spawns in these things. Oh, there we go. There is an AK. Hopefully, it has at least a mag with it. Yeah, there we go. It does. That's brilliant stuff. We'll take that. Oh, I'm going to have to get rid of the frag grenade. Don't want the frag grenade. And the can uh, ten. And let's just put that in there. Can I put that back in there? No. Right now we have an AK. So we have a weapon with two rounds, 45 
ammo, it, it's just a normal AK, very powerful weapon though. So we have a weapon which is fantastic stuff. Um, so we see the bandits, I've, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to shoot them and kill them on sight, unless he's with uh, more than one person. I think there was at least three of them there when they took me there, which is terrible. The worst thing is they unclosed me, it's kind of weird. Which means they got all my gear as well, which was uh, terrible. That, that AK was a lucky find. It was a very lucky find at all, indeed. Um, shops, there's hardly anything ever in there. Uh, I would, I don't know, in, in Daisy, or I mean Exile, you're just going to have to like go with the flow. Like You see a store, you can check it, but if you see what I mean, there's going to be, there's always, there's never anything in here. Got a ciggies on the floor. Uh, nothing much here. There's a plastic bottle on the floor, but I can't pick it up. It's just there for show. I know I didn't check the whole thing, but I didn't really want to waste time doing it. Oh, I can't get over that. That's, uh, can't get over how I can't get over that. Um, we just really need a change of clothing, which is going to be fantastic if we find some. Um, I'd recommend not checking any houses. These houses do give you some nice stuff, you know, if they can be bothered to do it so like normally you don't find anything in cities and you've got to go to places and, and stuff like that and it's just a it's a very terrible idea to do so Eric um, the thing is how we got split was Eric ran away and it just didn't go very well he ran away because I told him to run after I got shot in the leg he was gonna stay and help me I was like no run I passed out from the blood loss obviously they got me up my leg still hurts a tiny bit but I can still run on it, still run on it, which is fantastic. I just need to get as far away as that junkyard I possibly can because that is the base of action. It's very nice, very secure. No one wants to go to a junkyard, do they? You see, I, the reason why I go in these houses all the time is because they do spawn some. They used to spawn some good stuff on armor and uh, Daisy standalone, so they're my top houses to look at. But at the moment, I don't seem to be finding anything. I don't know if anyone's been. For me, maybe the bandits, bandits have secured this place, taken everything they could find and go. That's why I'm finding it hard to. Uh, it's starting to rain a bit now, which is which is, which is not good. Um, nothing again. Hopefully, we'll find some sort of clothing. Nothing again. And nothing. Or would you look at that? Right, since it's starting to uh, rain, let me just get into this orange house in here. Plan out a route. Go to the. Um, Go to the military compound. Oh, I thought that was a car over there I could use. That gets us so far. Keep us dry and everything. I know I'm not shutting these doors behind me, but it's uh, I don't hear any zombies on me, so I don't see the point. I'll shut this door now. We'll plant a route. Let's have a look where we are. We will uh, plant a route over. So we've got to go over that way over the dirt track to get there. We could go all the way there to change the gear, or we could just meet Eric at the power station while we're waiting. I um, we'll just put, I reckon going with that with Eric would be great a great idea if we go there with Eric. We're gonna we're gonna go straight up to meet him, so it's just forward. Right, we will let's let's get there and hope he's fine. Let's go. We seem to have got here and uh I can't find him anywhere but there's a couple of zombies a couple of zombies on me and I really hope he's here so he can help me. I don't know. Hopefully he can zombies. That is a scary motherfucking face. Shots. Don't know where they're coming from. Hello, Eric, is that you? Better boy. Fuck yeah. Here we are, we are reunited Holy shit, back. Man. Thank you for saving my ass like five times. What happened to you? Yeah, uh, yeah, no problem, man. Where's your, uh, what? Where's your gilly? Oh yeah, funny story. Um, I kind of got shot in the back. Shit. Lost conscious. Took me clothes. Left me for dead. I see you. You've uh... after a while. What? No, no, go on, keep going. No, tell me your story. Tell me your story. And then I woke up on the road. Um, surrounded by zombies. And that's when I noticed that you were gone. So I went out traveling, to see if I could find you. I got. Uh, I got shot by the resort, and I heard shots. That's good. So you you came here yeah, thinking it'd be me. 
Well, yeah, because only you shoot like a fucking maniac. Thank you for that. <laughs> thank you. I thought you could have been. You got to. So you didn't. Hopefully, you didn't encounter the bandits that got me. They kill. They shot me in the foot. I. It's happened to me. Me. I, I thought I died of blood loss, and then they took me back to the. I woke up in the junkyard in this monkey suit with a number on it. They did some experiments on me. My head hurts. My leg hurts. Where I've been shot, but they. They cleared it up pretty well. You got, you, you got a number on your back. Oh, another zombie. You got a number on I've got back. a number on the front of me, as you can see. What kind of sick people got you? I don't know, but I got out of there. I heard them, I, I pretended to still be consci unconscious, and I heard them say, well, let's go out, get some supplies. So let, let's get out of here. And yeah, we'll, yeah, uh, it's roaming with zombies. Um, no bullets left. And then we'll uh, use some more to save you. We'll find. There's a lot of zombies here. A lot of zombies. Oh, here. let's head over to. You got a problem? Let's get out of here. The military base we want to head over to is behind us. So let's uh, let's get there now. Here we are. We've made it. Without getting shot or killed in the dark. You need to get some clothes, Eric. You're probably freezing. Oh me, yeah. Those bandits, man, took me clothes. Uh, it's been a cold night, for sure. They might have raped you. Well, I shot the hot knots, like... <laughs> I haven't felt anything, but, um... Quite yeah, light. I haven't checked myself. <laughs> it's quite light here. Yeah, 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 exactly. Um, you reckon there's anyone here? Any survivors? There could be. Hope not though. Either that or zombies. Well, anyhow, That's an we need to get in there. Plan is be quiet, sneak around, don't attract any zombies. That's where's the heli landed there, but where's the heli? If only, if only. Guaranteed nothing in here, like usual in XR. Welcome to XR, everybody. Where you <laughs> want to find gear, but there is none. Ah, it's becoming night time. It's about time. And yeah, I can see. I'm beginning to freeze my head off. Oh, just got a lag spike there. I do apologise. Have you checked that tower? There might be stuff. I in doubt that there'll be anything there. The usefulness. I think there's gear in, gear in here. Hello? Ah, uh, it's all abandoned, man. Yeah, I don't think there's anybody here. Unless we find someone sleeping in the beds, then... then maybe. This tower, though, like... Like, it's so big, is it, is it a radio tower? Oh, okay, dude, there's an M... Oh! Uh, there's, there's a gun here. <gasps> oh, oh my, oh my, there's zombies here. Yeah, come in here, there's a gun in here. There's a gun in here. In here. On the floor for you. Just in there, I think it's an M49. Did he follow you? They haven't seen you. It's, yeah, it's an M14, man. Ho. Oh. Quality web. There's a Victor in here. And a sniper with no scope. I'll leave that. <gasps> Get out of there, he's coming in, he's coming in. There's a zombie just standing outside. Letting off shots. Yeah, I'm running, I'm running. Him. Over here. I think the base is lost. No signs of life whatsoever. There must be some clothing here somewhere. There's another barracks here. We'll keep checking for clothing. Oh, it's filled to the brim with them dead folks. Uh, it probably is. Terrible way to go. If I'm getting eaten by a zombie, I want you to shoot me. If you get bitten by a zombie, I will happily do it. Cheers, thank you. <laughs> no friend of mine is going to turn into that freak. Is there nothing here? Nothing. Welcome. It's all raided. Yep, welcome to Exile. But nothing you want is ever here. Oh, there's a zombie right there. Uh -oh. That probably alerted all the zombies in the area. There's an ATV, ATV here, there's an ATV oh. here. Don't get on it, don't get on it yet. What a shot. 
Another one coming out. Get in here. Oh! Nice, thank you. Hold up, hold up in the building. Are there any more coming? Yeah, there's one more here. He's down, one down, one more to go. He's down. Nice shot, man. Alright, I really hope there's some sort of clothing in here. Anything will do. Check in the vehicle. Anything in the vehicle? Oh, it's locked. Oh, no. <laughs> How do you lock an ATV? <laughs> I think you might have bought it from the, uh, bought it from the trade points, survivor trade points. Oh, yes. There is gear in these. There's a backpack. Oh, you can enter there. this building? GPS as well, that's fantastic. I've got myself a backpack now, a big backpack. So we can put some stuff in there. We've got a backpack. Get our base going, yeah. Check the towers, it's uh... Oh man, I found... Carrier rig. H in the th uh, G36. I'm taking that with me. Oh yeah. Oh, there's, there's, uh, there's cat food, do you want some cat food? Check the zombies, they always, uh, have, they always have cat food on them. <laughs> Yow. There's a lot of zombies spawning oh, here. I got some sweet ass night goggles, man. Have you actually? That's good. Can I take your M4? Because I've got no more ammo besides five, so I'm going to take your M4. Really? Yeah, if you want to. Yeah, sure. Can I get through this door here, hopefully? There's also a uh, 9mm sting here. Whereabouts? Two magazines. Whereabouts was your M4? I'm sorry, what? Whereabouts was your oh, gun? Oh, my rifle. Yeah. Uh, in here. Nice. Oh, where's the ammo? Uh... Is it on you? It's supposed to be on... It's on the gun. It's only one magazine oh, and it's been no, the gun. No, don't, don't worry about it. I'll take this yeah. one. Yeah. There we go. Get rid of that. This. Put that. Oh, mate. Don't Come upstairs for a second. <laughs> you found a wetsuit, what is this? I found a jumpsuit, is, it, is that your jumpsuit? <laughs> oh, I... Go for a swim. Change your clothes, there you go. Nice. Oh, this has got quite a lot of loot in it, I'm glad about that. It was, it was. As soon as I said that, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> and again. Looks like looks like not everything got looted. <laughs> oh, there's a balcony here. Where do you reckon those bandits are? That uh, oh, they didn't kill. Uh, almost killed me and kidnapped you. They didn't say where they were going, but they're they're planning on getting a plane and heading over to the island next to us, which is Toana, I think they said. Toana. Yeah. Well, maybe we should get a plane and go there. Maybe we should so give them a bit of payback. Maybe they're maybe they're safe from this uh, horrible apocalypse. Oh, there's. There we go. We'll go over here, check this tower. We'll go over there and check that tower, and then hopefully it'll be uh, it'll be a good run. All right. Yeah, I'm going to the right here. Check that tower. You check the one on the left here. What one on the What's there? this? Is this a? Oh, it's a road. Look at this. <gasps> oh, I'm alive. What? Are you okay, better boy. <laughs> I'm, I'm okay, but there's a lot of vehicles here. A lot of broken down vehicles, tanks. Looks like the military had some problems. Oh, there's a, there's a little hut here as well. Everything oh. seems to be open in it besides the door. So hopefully, uh, no in exile, I'm going to look at it and there's going to be a great big nothing. Oh no, I lied. There is a combat helmet, which I'll take. And I'll take some smoke as well, just in case we need it. So yeah. So I've got a nice helmet on. Let's check the roof. Oh, there's a big weapon here if you want it. Do you want a... Oh, I'll take it. What weapon is it? It's a uh, big heavy machine gun. Uh, no, thank you. Yeah, I do. So this is what happened to the military, huh? Yeah. No wonder Run they down. couldn't help us. We're stuck in a traffic jam. Yeah. 
<laughs> Rush hour, up, you know. Did you check this tower up here? Uh, I checked the one behind us. Anything? Found a weapon. I found a weapon, yeah. A. Whoa. It's a. It's a ACR. Oh, yeah, that's quite good. And that, that's my backup weapon in case I, uh, I guess this weapon runs dry. Yeah, that's good. So we're well prepared if we meet those filthy bandits again, I can say that. It did say, I need water apparently, so, or I'm going to die. Oh, I've got fresh oh. water. Let me just get that out. A gift from the gods. Oh, let me cancel. So, I wanted to check the map and uh, figure out where to go next. Well, we need some, uh, some food. Do you have any food? I'm dry, so. Okay. I suggest he heading to the nearest city and trying to scavenge some food, some supplies. Why don't we oh. head over to Petrol Grounds? I was just there. Go through that. that. That's a, get that's a helicopter. Oh, it's, it's one of those ones. Military stealth. Military stealth, yeah. So it is. I thought the military was was gone from this area. They're probably dropping off more people to help. I hope. It's a kill. Right, I reckon we should head over to the trader zone. The trader zone will be much easier for us, hopefully. It's a safe zone. Um, there's probably a few friendly people there that can help us out. Sounds good, but um, don't have any money, so... <laughs> Can't buy anything. We, we can get money on the way. Yeah, probably. Right. All right. Let's Wanna head out then? Let's head to it. Let's go. In the woods. Yeah. So we're still travelling over to the survivors base, and we've just found whatever this is. Big plane. Oh man! The name of it. Uh, look in the, look in the uh, front seat. Oh shit. <laughs> Someone's been having a bad time. <laughs> yeah. Someone obviously didn't get the latest meal deal with Domino's Pizza. <laughs> <laughs> but Poor lads. I want to go... I don't really want to go to that cabin in the woods because what happens when you go in a cabin in the woods? You die. What happens when you go with a mate? You and your mate die. What's, and that's... The survivor. Wow, look at that house. Oh, is that's that a church, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. Oh, a look. mosque, maybe? There's people, traders. I think the limited time you can stay in here is, I think, three days, three nights, then you've got to move on. They're trying to encourage people to get out there, make your own houses, make it safe. That's what they're trying to do. Policy. Alright, we need to lower our weapons. I don't want to start any panic. But I don't want to threaten anyone. I'm pretty sure they get people coming with weapons all the time. Probably not in scooper gear though. It's kind of weird. Hi, I'm all latex up for for you and me bitches. Right, we're here, and we're going to be staying here for a couple of nights. So getting thank geared you. up, getting supplies. And then we're going to go all out the there. good. While we're here, we're going to take a nap. We haven't slept in about, what was it, since we got here, which was three days ago. So we're going to take a good, well-earned sleep. Right here. In that tent. Thank you very much. We'll see you in the next episode.